Epson Media Installer is available for both Mac and Windows. This is the Mac version. The Windows version has the same functionality with some subtle differences. At the top, there are two tabs, Media Management and Media Download. And under the Media Management tab, these are the icons that would be used to set the mechanical parameters of a printer. This icon is to copy media, to edit media, to remove media, to import EMX and EMY files, and to export EMY files. This is where you would select the printer that you're going to be using with Epson Media Installer. And the refresh button can be used to reload media. Media types are by category. These are photo papers, which use photo black ink, proofing paper for CMYK, fine art paper for matte black ink, canvas, and others. These are the media names. And in this column, when you see this blue icon, this will provide information specific to this particular media. This column will indicate medias that are registered, not acquired, which we'll discuss in an upcoming video. And this column indicates if a media is editable and or removable. When clicking on media download, you will receive this processing update. The time this is on will vary based on your system. And this will take you to all of the Epson available medias. These are the names, the media type. This column will have any information specific to a media. This column will show if there are any updates to medias. If a media is registered, not registered, or not acquired, which we will review in upcoming videos. And the last column shows when the media was last updated.